Hey guys, uh, here I am trying to make some uh, fluffy eggs. Uh, never tried it before, saw it on the internet, uh, just had some extra egg white sticking around. Uh, so I've been sitting here uh, beating this egg white for about 15 minutes, maybe 20 minutes. Uh, not my favorite way to do it. Next time I would definitely uh, get one of those uh, machines that does it for you. But I was like, oh, I think I can do it with my hand. Ah, bad idea. Uh, actually, my fiance has been helping me. We've had to take turns because my hand's been getting tired. Uh, but the, the thought is, you in the egg white, you put a little bit of sugar, and then you try to aerate it. So I'm using a fork, okay? And you can't see very well, but see how it's starting to stick up? We're almost getting to where we need to be, so I'm gonna do a little bit longer. And then what I'll do is I'll take my egg yolk that I have in my other bowl, and I will just fold this in lightly, okay? Not too hard, because uh, you don't want to lose the air that you've been putting into this for the last 20 minutes. Uh, this is insane, all right? Uh, so I'm gonna turn on my uh, burner because you want this to all happen pretty quickly and again this is my first time I don't know experimenting eggs oh my which came first the egg or the death of my arm from mixing this egg white for so long okay starting to get those peaks oh yeah And I probably should do it a little bit longer, but I'm getting a little bit uh, annoyed with it. So I'm almost done because my arm's about to fall off. Okay, sorry, I had to leave for a second. Had my, uh, my fiance to take over some of the whipping so it could go a little bit longer. Uh, but I do want to start heating up my pan, uh, getting the butter melted uh, so we can get a nice Hopefully, nice fluffy egg with a nice, beautiful, golden brown crust of sorts. Okay, in the egg yolk, that's just the egg yolk, and just a little bit of salt. Okay, uh, we just did one egg. Uh, when I saw it demonstrated, they had two eggs, so I hope that this is enough to make a nice fluffy egg. Okay, my butter is melted in the pan. So, just let that warm up a little bit more. Okay. So, we're gonna try it. It's about as much fluff as I can get right now, but we're getting those peaks like I was talking about that's holding up pretty well. Okay, so we're gonna try it. And I'm just gonna pour in my egg yolk. Okay, and then slowly, gently fold it in. Okay, try to get as much of that egg as possible. And then I'm just going to be gentle. Try to fold it gently. Okay, because now I don't want to beat that egg white anymore. Okay, so I'm just mixing it carefully. Uh, doesn't have really any yellow color to it. So this will be interesting to see what it tastes like once we cook it, but hey, only learn by doing and trying things out. Okay, so I've mixed everything in there. So I'm just gonna pour this into the pan because it's warmed up now. And we'll see what happens. Spent too much time not to get as much egg as possible. Okay, and I'm just trying to evenly spread it out on the pan here. Really hope this turns out good. That was a lot of time whipping. It literally was about 20 minutes. Okay, so I have a medium high heat uh, to cook the egg. 
and I am super nervous that this is not going to work out. I don't know if I use enough butter. I don't know if I put too much sugar in to the egg white. Uh, I don't know if I should have beat it longer or not as long. Okay, the bottom is actually looking pretty good. Okay, so uh, yeah, it works. So I'm gonna turn down the heat because that is a little bit browner than I was expecting to be honest. Uh, so I know I need to turn down the heat, uh, so hopefully that doesn't ruin the flavor, okay? Because uh, I don't like burnt eggs, and it is nice and fluffy though, so I'm really excited about this. Now, in the video I saw this, they actually were able to fold it and then flip it. I don't know how to do that, so I'm just trying to do this. It's fluffy. It looks... <laughs> It looks fun. Oop. So some of my fluff, some of my fluff came off. Just throw that back in there. Okay. So the low approach uh, for heat, I think, works because you want to make sure that the middle gets cooked too. You don't want to eat raw eggs. Uh, if you have it too high, it's going to burn. Uh, so I messed up a little bit. It happens. I don't think it'll be ruined. Uh, but I am going to get my plates uh, so we can try to enjoy this uh, hopefully really soon. Okay, got my plate. Okay, and that's the other side. I'm going to see if I can fold it. No, not going to try to fold it. It's nice and fluffy. Twice the size, three times, four times the size of a normal uh, egg omelet. Uh, so there you go. Sorry for the uh, the lighting, but it is fluffy. It is a bit thicker than my finger. Uh, I'm gonna go eat because I'm hungry. Uh, ask me how to do it if you want to try. Uh, hopefully it's good. Bye. Hey guys, uh, so I just wanted to share with you, I started eating it, and it is nice and fluffy. It's like eating um, probably a cloud of egg, an egg cloud. Uh, there's a little bit of sweetness from the sugar, but it's kind of crazy. All those little air pockets in there, that is nice and fluffy. Uh, definitely recommend giving it a shot. Uh, but be ready to eat it right away because it started deflating as soon as I took it off the heat. So it is delicious. Uh, use an egg beater. Don't try to do the hand thing because that was not fun. But go ahead, try it out. Eat some eggs. Eat the egg clouds. Love it. Taste it. Delicious. Adios.